It's very well painted. Oh yeah. Look at those little goosies. That's exactly what I need. <laughs> Hey everybody, Fat Bird Finds here. I'm Mary Beth. And I'm Laura. And George is behind us. <laughs> and we're getting ready to go in his house and check <laughs> out his is. sale. I'm so excited. <laughs> Me too. Me too. <laughs> Good plan. We're right behind you. <laughs> I don't know. Oh no, it smells like uh, gas. Light and there isn't any in this, so I'm not sure if it's something that washes in from elsewhere or what. Look at her. <laughs> She's pretty awesome. <laughs> Look at those. Look at those earrings. Those are cool. They have crabs on them. I know. Awesome. <laughs> Hi, Laura, what do you see over here? Oh my gosh, there's, he's got so many cute things. Like, look at this. Look at this little thing here. Isn't that awesome? You, you like, make your own perfume. Oh, interesting. Isn't that cute? Like, you can mix all the scents and... That's very cool. I know. I think that's so cool. I love that. Look and at that, that snail. I know. Look, it's a little trinket box. I think I want those. Oh. Isn't that sweet? That's adorable. There's a little magnet, so it makes it really cute. It just, like, pops right back on there. I and like look, him. Here's a little lion one, too. I really like those. I think we should get those. Okay. Oh, here's some ephemera. $5 for all stamps. Oh, those old envelopes. Those are sweet. I love those. I like putting stuff like that in the mystery boxes for mm -hmm. people to like junk journal with and stuff. Yeah. I really like that. That's cool. And then look at these little cigarette cards. Oops. Aren't they cute? Have you ever seen those before in I real have. life? Yes. Those are so cute. Look at that hologram on the front of that Rolling Stone. I've never seen that on the front of a magazine before. I got Rolling Stone for a hot minute Let's when I was see. younger. <laughs> Look. See? Isn't that cool? Oh, yeah. It? Like a uh, magic, what do you call that? When it moves like that? That's cool. And magic motion. Yeah, motion. and it's like 3D. See, they, they, he looks like he's like way ahead of. That's oh, awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see it now. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that is cool. It has weird things in magazines. I'll fix our cell phone. You're good. <laughs> Don't forget, I have a mic when I was too. <laughs> 16, when I was 16 or 17, this Whoops. Are you breaking stuff? No. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. Say hi to everybody. Hi. I've got my hands full. That's good. Look at him. <laughs> Look, he looks like he's really had a bad day. He's cute though. Ooh, I like that tablecloth. It's not my size. It's not my size, Zeno, but man. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Look at this tablecloth, Laura. 
Oh, I like that. Me too. And look at this. Oh, look this at is cute. Oh, that's cool. Very neat. Did you find an apron? Yeah, look. It's that's California. Pretty. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Oh yeah, no, that's more you can like put a it. Goldfish down there. <laughs> that's more like it right there. Holy smokes! <laughs> Please, sir. Oh yeah. That's a Mary Beth's prom shoes. <laughs> wow, Livingston County. Was... <laughs> I did have some pretty awesome prom shoes I'm though. They you. were like that iridescent looking stuff that looked like different colors when you moved. That's pretty. Mm -hmm. I feel like that could have been in our pink sale last night. Oh yeah. <laughs> this ended up having a hole in it. Otherwise I would have gotten that. I really love that color. It's got some pretty afghans here too. I can't hardly stand to think about afghans right now because it's so <laughs> hot. I know. <gasps> I like those. What? This chicken. Oh, those are cute. I saw those too. I think those are really cute. I'm going to check those out closer and maybe get those. Quality is like buying oats. If you want good, clean oats, you must pay a fair price. However, if you are satisfied with oats that have already been through the horse, well, they're a little cheaper. <laughs> I love how you're just like bringing us all these really funny things. For the next life, though. The disclaimer, right? That's great. Man, if you know anything about cameras, which I don't, this is like the place to be. So much camera stuff. Ooh, I like that. This little ewer. Let's see if I can get that focused. Right there. That's pretty. You finding anything? Um, I was looking at the games. Any of those playing cards for package shoppers? Mom wanted him, but she's been here. Maybe she missed him. He's a, um, not Wooster. George will have to tell me again what it is. I forget. Well, maybe she just missed him. Little bitty tiny things. Look at that. Yeah, I saw those. <laughs> Very cute. Is that an alligator? Mm-hmm. Oh. <laughs> I like him. George is like trying to wrap it up. He's gonna be ready to collapse. He's gonna be ready to kick us out of here. Oh, look how pretty that is. He still has a lot of really good stuff here. He really does. I haven't even looked up. Lots of pictures. I like those pelicans over there on the wall. Those are funny. Yeah, sometimes you have to back up. <laughs> It is a hot day, friends. I'm sure I look a hot mess for this video. Zeno was laughing at that deer paint by number. It looks like he's been punched in the face. <laughs> it looks like he's really like lost a fight or a bet. 
or something. I thought mine was bad. <laughs> okay, Laura. So we were a little late to the game at George's sale, right? He had already been doing it pretty much two full days. A little late to the party. A little late to the party. But we did find some really cute stuff. Yeah, everybody likes different things. That's why you should never give up hope. <laughs> so we rarely ever pick up milk glass. But I just love the pattern on this one. Me too. Look how pretty that is. That was striking to me. I liked it a lot. So striking. I love it. That's a really good one, I think. Really good candy dish. That would look good with like peppermints or something in there. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm a big fan. I like that one a lot. And I don't usually like a lot of milk glass. Awesome. Then we got a some ephemera. Yeah, so here's a little stack of cards. Aren't they sweet? Oh, they're like little baby cards. I know, so those can go like in the top of our mystery boxes. Look at that one. Oh, I need my glasses on for that. How sweet. But I love these. Those are really cute. <laughs> and in the bottom, we have like some stamped envelopes or like remnants of envelopes with old stamps on them. Yeah, I think somebody was collecting that stash for the stamps. Yeah, I think but you're right. But how cute. The whole thing would be, the whole envelope and everything is cute in a junk journaling situation. Yeah, I agree. Very fun. Or if you just like the stamps. Very cool. Laura picked up a teacup and saucer. Oh, your favorite, Mary Beth. A fancy <laughs> teacup and saucer. <laughs> Sometimes I can't resist, though. I just think they're so pretty. Let's see what this one is. Foley China. Mm -hmm. Very cute. Made in England. Nice. So that's really pretty, I think. Very good. And you can tell it's fancier and a little more valuable because it's got that all over pattern. Oh, it's so fancy. <laughs> I know. What's this? I didn't see you pick this up. Look at that. It's a little Gouda vase. So George taught, has taught me about Gouda pottery, which I still don't know very much about, but I know that I like it <laughs> and I like the look of it whenever I see it. And that's a little piece. There's an original sticker there. Cool. I like it. Then you have a little elephant. That was for fun. Just for me. Look. Little oh, he elephant. Has a, he has a crown on. And a heart. Where's the heart? On his back. Her back. Oh, cute. So that can be a bonus elephant sometime probably, right? Look, it's Betsy Johnson. So it's cute. It's Who's it's Betsy not, Johnson? It's not vintage, <laughs> but... And why do you have her necklace? It's not cute. She's like a crazy designer. I like it. all this wild and crazy kind of stuff. Kitschy stuff. Very fun. Love it. Then we picked up these swizzle sticks. <laughs> yes, we had a lot of fun trying to decipher the, the pun that was intended on these. Exactly. It's funny, though, right? We had fun with those. And I love that they're still in their package. Very cool. Okay, this looks like some wedge wood. Yep, a little wedge wood covered dish. Isn't I'll let that you pretty? take the lid off. Got it? Mm hmm. It's marked real tiny somewhere. Yeah, I it's saw right it. there. It's not one to focus, but yeah, it's right there. Very nice. Very good. Mm -hmm. You got it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, then here's some of my favorite stuff. First of all, I picked up <laughs> this little alligator. I found him and I couldn't leave him behind. Look how small he is. And he has a little hole. So maybe he was once a bracelet or a necklace or something. But I just couldn't not pick him up. <laughs> he was like calling out to me. He was like, don't leave me. me. Smile. That's so funny. <laughs> And then we picked up this little cream and sugar that are these chickens. But wait, it's a secret because not only are they cream and sugar, but they're also salt and pepper. I promise you, I've seen a lot of stuff and I don't, I've never seen combination cream and sugar, salt and pepper shakers. Right? I mean, I'm sure they, you know, I've just missed them somehow, but what a, Cute surprise. I can't stand it. I can't deal with it. That's like my favorite thing that we got, I think. <laughs> okay, so onward. Laura picked up a little ballerina jewelry box. Oh, look. Somebody's decoupaged their little 
design on there, but we're going to fill that up with jewelry sometime for a jewelry vintage mystery box. That'll be good. Isn't that cute? Very nice. It's kind of scuffed on the edges, but that's okay. Okay, we're going to skip ahead to the linens. Laura, do you want to like hold them up? Yeah, I'll show them. Okay. There's a cute little apron. Oh, how that's nice. Great. That's cool. It says California aprons. Well, there you go. Made in Japan. Cool. I like that color too. Oh, look, I think that's like a little scarf that's sewn onto the apron. That's Isn't that cute. sweet? That's a really good idea. And then I love this little tablecloth. I'll open it halfway. How's that? That's perfect. Isn't that pretty? Very lovely. I just really like those colors. So it's probably card table size. Okay. And then this is a really pretty dresser blanket. Dresser blanket, as you would call it. <laughs> I like it when it's cut like that and you can see through to the wood. I agree. And look, it's pretty long. Yeah, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. Good one. Okay, and then what? You picked up some hankies? Yes. And so there's a pretty, they're just your average little hankies, but there's a little pink sheer one. And then this one is brown with blue roses. And then that one. Cute. Great. Well done. Then we have this little guy. This little frog. Yes, he is Royal Crown Derby. Royal Crown Derby. Not to be confused with Crown Royal. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> then we have another linen. This has got flowers on it. And this is, I think, a tea towel, don't you think? Yes, and it actually, this one actually is linen. Yeah, it is. I think, you know, and it's uh, still got the tags. Awesome. From Australia, pure linen in Australia. Very good. So I like, somebody will really like that. Okay, and the last item is this sweet little planter who is a pheasant. You think it's a dogwood, Laura? <laughs> or a Here magnolia. We go with, with our age old debate. I don't think it is, Mary Beth. I think it's a dogwood. I don't think it is. I'm going dogwood all the way. But it's similar, so I'll give you that. And there's that little guy. Look at his sweet little face. He's got that little flower box behind him. You can put your plants in there. Did you say he's a pheasant? He's a pheasant. Yeah, I said pheasant. Oh, okay. <laughs> Stop trying to make fun of me. But did you say what he was? I think he's, isn't he whole? Yeah, I don't think he's marked, though. Oh, okay. But George said he was Hull, and I'll take George's word for it. <laughs> Whatever George says goes, in my opinion. Absolutely. Okay, so that's our little haul from George's estate sale, and we were super happy to attend. Okay, so, Laura, we had a great time at George's little estate sale. Always so much fun to see George and Zeno this time. I know. <laughs> it was so good. Such a hot day, though. But we had a great, really good time. We did. So, guys, make sure that if you saw anything in the haul that you're interested in, send us an email, fatbirdfinds at gmail.com, and we can sell to you that way. It's the best way to buy something. So make sure you like this video. Leave us a comment below. Let us know what your favorite item was. Subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, and make sure you stay tuned to see what Fatbird finds next. See you next time. Bye, everybody.